It's feeling a little bit like the holidays here at the airport. Take a look at the Southwest ticket counter. There's some Christmas decorations. Now, there's a decent number of travelers, relatively speaking, and especially considering the stay at home order, but it is far from packed. You got plenty of space to distance yourself. Masks are mandatory on airport property. SAC International says they're maintaining all of their enhanced health measures, but increased cleaning on frequent touch points, such as the TSA bins, for example. But the travelers we spoke with are flying to spend the holiday with family. Portland to visit my daughter for Christmas. Yeah. How are you feeling? Pretty good. We've got lots of masks and lots of hand sanitizer and headrest covers and <laughs> gloves and disposable everything. So. Feeling good. Some have flown multiple times this year and feel comfortable. They're going to go see their son, and we're going to go see our son in Fort Collins. Great. Fine. I mean, I just great. wear your mask, do yeah. your. And if the bars open, we'll feel and... better. <laughs> just reminding folks that that social distancing aspect, once they get into the airport, um, is really critical, um, and it's really a, a self. Um, self-policing so you know if there's too many people on the tram or too many people on the bus you know just waiting for that next one so that you can maintain a lot of that social distancing the airport expects today and sunday to be the busiest travel days of the week similar to thanksgiving weekend they'll have exact numbers next week at sac international airport vicky gonzalez kcra 3 news